Hey folks, Elvis Vaughn, General Manager, Killer Creek Harley-Davidson, coming to you today with two new Harley-Davidson models and two very lovely models. We have Sarah on a 2018 FX FB Fat Bob, and we've got Kristen on the all-new FX DR that's for Dyna replacement. I'm just kidding. I just wanted to be one of the first people to say that. So we're going to talk about some of the similarities and some of the differences. Let's get started with the Fat Bob. Fat Bob introduced in 2018 as a soft tail flagship model, kind of your performance cruiser. Came uh, with a far more compact chassis and frame assembly in that the uh, bike uh, features a steeper rake. Uh, so the, the bike uh, is very nimble and agile. It's at home on uh, 50 mountain roads uh, or any place else that you want to uh, you know, get down and uh, really ride aggressively. Uh, it's got a more traditional uh, set up with a drag style handlebar and uh, your, your typical uh, Harley Davidson uh, turn signals. It's got uh, the uh, tritone finished exhaust system. And of course, both the motorcycles feature the Milwaukee 8, 114 cubic inch motor. And they also both feature uh, the triple disc brake system. Let's talk about the all new for 2019 FXDR. The first thing you're gonna notice is that new air cleaner assembly and that exhaust system that's unique to the bike. This bike breaks the traditional Harley Davidson mold and that has far more angular styling. It's got a big beefy swing arm and a 240 millimeter back tire. And just look at that tail section. It's completely unique to this model. All new turn signals, front and rear. You'll come up here and check out this dash display. This bike is unique and then it's got this very cool multi-function instrument display we'll cycle through here real quick for you of course you got your speedo your trip meters miles remaining on the tank time of day your rpm indicator and uh, of course your uh, odometer um, this bike all new 2019 uh, is definitely uh, breaking the mold and uh, shaking the motorcycle world up Two motorcycles, basically intended to compete more or less in the same space. Again, the Fat Bob I feel is probably a little more at home on a tight, twisty mountain road, whereas the FXDR is going to favor the long sweeping turns, longer, lower profile. Uh, both of them would serve an individual well. Horsepower junkies, uh, guys that are uh, possibly transitioning over from sport bikes, uh, they're, they're, they're two great options. I know if I were in the market for a bike like this, I would be really hard pressed to pick a clear winner and say absolutely unequivocally one is better than the other. Ladies? 